The late James Gandolfini became one of the most respected dramatic actors in Hollywood. James Joseph Gandolfini was born on September 18, 1961 in Westwood, New Jersey. The American actor is best known for his portrayal of mafia boss and family man Tony Soprano in the HBO drama series The Sopranos. Gandolfini was the son of Italian immigrants. In 1983, he graduated from Rutgers University in New Jersey with a degree in communications. Before making his career in film, Gandolfini appeared on Broadway, first gaining acclaim in a 1992 production of A Streetcar Named Desire that also starred Alec Baldwin and Jessica Lange. That same year, he began appearing in small roles on the big screen. In 1993, Gandolfini was cast as the woman-beating mob enforcer, Virgil, in Quentin Tarantino's True Romance. He continued to be cast as dangerous tough guys in films. Although respected for his work in these films, Gandolfini became an icon for his role of a lifetime on The Sopranos, which debuted on HBO in 1999. He won three Emmy Awards as an outstanding lead actor in a drama series for his role. After six seasons, The Sopranos ended in 2007. While appearing in The Sopranos, Gandolfini continued to appear in feature films. He demonstrated his range in very different roles in different movies. In 2001, he played a gay hitman in The Mexican. In the film drama Welcome to the Rileys, Gandolfini starred as a grieving father who finds a connection with a wayward teenage girl. He portrayed the real-life producer of a 70s television documentary series in the HBO movie Cinema Verite. Before returning to the big screen with supporting roles in the crime films Violet and Daisy and Killing Them Softly. Gandolfini later appeared in Not Fade Away in 2012 and as Leon Panetta in Zero Dark Thirty about the US military operation to kill Osama bin Laden. Gandolfini had returned to Broadway in 2009, earning critical acclaim in God of Carnage a satirical comedy centered on two couples who meet following a fight between their young sons. Sadly, while vacationing in Rome in June 2013, Gandolfini died of a heart attack. The romantic comedy Enough Said, in which he played a divorced father embarking on a new relationship, and the crime drama The Drop 2014, in which he played a corrupt bar owner, were released posthumously. Today, fans continue to remember his intensity, his dedication to his craft, and his memorable performances on stage and on screen.